hey you guys welcome back to my channel so today you guys we're gonna do something different I got a chance to get out so I did a little thrifting and I wanted to show you guys what I got so stay tuned <laughs> All right, you guys, so let's get busy. Let me show you what I got. Um, so yeah, when I got to the, I actually went to Goodwill. So when I got there, it was pretty decent. You know, I was like, I was feeling good about everything. As I started shopping, there was like more and more people coming in. I think I got there probably about 10 minutes after it opened. So I guess I was fairly early, but I expected um, you know people to be in line simply because it was one of those days where they had like 50% off the whole store and then a color tag would be um, a dollar so yeah so but then when I was coming out you know as I was shopping it was just like oh my god like so many more people coming in there you know of course some had masks some didn't so you know I was just saying to myself okay get a couple more things and then I'm gonna get out of here but let me tell you so I went straight to um, Colts and things like that because I knew like there wouldn't be a lot of people going toward that stuff I figured it would be more people trying to get like the summer things simply because we're in that season but me I'm thinking long term so I'm going toward like more of like your fall clothes and things like that because I do send things uh, out to um, thread up so by the time I send that into thread up and the time that they process everything is gonna pre be pretty much freaking fall because you know they take a long time I think my last bag that I sent there it took like well we were going through a pandemic so I gotta give them a couple you know points there but mm -hmm. Still, like y'all didn't have nobody working. I think it took like two months, two, three months for processing. So I don't know, but I'm happy about the stuff that they did process because it's so right off the rip. So, all right, so let me show you guys what I have. So, first, we're going to start off with shoes, and then I mean, my haul was okay. Like, I didn't, I have came up on a lot of good stuff before, but you know, this time. I don't know cuz I went to a thrift store like a week before this one I won't say a week probably like earlier probably like four days before and I mean everything was freaking gone like it was like Ross have you guys been in Ross if you went to Ross let me know in the comments because I went there the racks were empty I mean I didn't know if they were like closing down or what. So anyway, let's get started. So first I have, and then you guys, if you see anything you want, just let me know in the comments because I'm gonna give you first dibs and good price. So first I got these shoes. These are so cute. They are brand new, you guys. Look at that, never worn. So they are Jones, New York. They have like this gold buckle. Um, leather and this is a size nine and a half nine and a half they do have something going on right here with the heel but I'll disclose that looks like it's coming off a little bit I don't know I don't know maybe I can fix it I don't know I'm just gonna kind of let um, I'll just disclose it and let them fix it because I don't want to jack it up I'm not like a call those shoe people shoe repair people so yep so it has this little rivet like design on the back these are so cute so these will be cute for the fall so yeah size nine and a half the next one I got these shoes were let me see so this one let's see this was actually This one is actually a new shoe too. It's the Stetso Mucci. Mucci. Stetso Mucci. But they're um never been worn. 
never been worn. It's a size, let's see here, it's 39 and a half. I think that equates to seven and a half US. So these are nice. It has like a little animal print. Can you see that? I just need to like take a damn cloth and get some of that dust off. But these are brand new. I think these sell for about 20, 20 to $30 online. So should be pretty good. Then here I have another pair these are Vanelli Vanelli these are like I think these are like Italian shoes or something hold on let me let me check nope, nope it don't say that I don't know, but it's a size 11 medium. So nice little loafer. It looks like I have like a snake pattern type um, design, but these are kind of cute. Little comfy shoes, never worn before. Yep, so those are cute. So let's get to the clothes. Those were all the shoes that I have but I did get some clothes too. So first up, you guys are these trousers. These are so cute. They are by The Gap. It's eight regular by The Gap. These were a dollar. So it was like 50 cent off and then all the blue tags were a dollar. So I got all blue tags, but yep. And then they have like the cuff at the bottom. They're a nice thick, like, I want to say wool with the lining, cute pink lining in it. These are front. And that is you want to see, and I'm going to put um, different, I'm going to put them on different websites. So I have Posh, Poshmark, um, eBay, and eBay, and then I may send some into ThreadUp because I'm not finished. I want to go out and get more stuff over time because I like to send like a big bag out to, I don't know why my, a big bag up to, um, Red up. I have these express pants here. They're just a black casual pant. Um, no, I'm sorry. These are H&M. It's a size 8 H&M. Button up, zip down, front. And this is the back. They're just basic like um, casual black pants, but who doesn't need a pair of black pants, right? For you guys, I have two Dicky work shirts. I have one size medium and one is a small. They are brand new. Brand new button up. So I got those. I think these sell online for about 20 to 30 bucks. This here is a nice little, I think this is a summer shirt, Charter Club. I'm not sure, Charter Club. But this is a size 22W. This is a cute, I like the pattern on this. It has like the lime greens and browns. I think that is, those colors complement each other wonderfully. So it's kind of like a, tunic type shirt and it flares out so it's really cute i don't know i may send this one into thread up a lot of my big sizes sell really well on thread up another pair of black slacks casual this one is the express pair this is a size 12 regular so pretty much like the black ones it's your casual 
black pant. I love express pants. They they just fit me good. So I like them. And I like the quality because I've had some express pants that lasted for years. Now this one here, you guys, I think I got this one at Salvation Army. So it was I think I paid, yeah, I paid like two bucks for this one. So this is the Orvis vest. It's the Trout Bum. These go for about, I want to say like 25, 25 to 29 online. But this is really nice. It has that like checker quilted pattern with the side pockets that zip. It's really nice. We have Orvis right here on the side. Oh, I, I have another pair of shoes. These here are Greppo Gruppo Italiano. So they're genuine leather Italian shoes. Never worn. And these were, when I got these at um, Salvation Army 2, they were half off, so I paid three bucks for these. And I think these Greppo shoes can go for anywhere from like 30 to 40 bucks, depending on, these are Mary Jane's. These are really cute. They're comfy, heel not too high. So patent leather, never worn. So anywhere from 30 to 40 bucks, I wanna say 30. I don't know, we'll see. I'll probably put those on eBay. For this next bag, like I said, I'm going to um, get more stuff probably I don't know, I may check out Savers. You know, one of our Savers here in Las Vegas closed down the one on, if you're familiar with the area, um, Decatur and Sahara. Yeah, that one's no longer available. I have drove past there and the doors were like, it's locked. And then I got an email shortly thereafter saying that um, that store is gonna be permanently closed. So if you did, didn't know, sorry to be the bearer of bad news, but. <laughs> That one's kind of closer to me. It's not the biggest one. The biggest one, I think, is the one on Trop and, um, where is that one? I forget, but it's over, like, on the east side, like Trop and something. But I also like the one that is out on more southwest by Buffalo and Lake Mead. That one's pretty cool, too. This is a New York & Co. blazer. It's really cute. It's a size 16, I think. Yeah, 16. This is a really cute blazer. It's almost like new. It's beige and size 16. So I know this one will really sell. I could probably get about, I want to say like anywhere from 19 to 26 bucks for this. So... Next up is my Covington blazers. I love blazers, you guys. I'm just like, you know how people like certain things, like some people like bags and stuff. I like bags too, but I like coats and watches. Not so much watches anymore, but I used to, I mean, I still like to look at them, but I don't wear watches simply because that much anymore because of the phones. But I'm starting to get back into them because I see some really nice ones that I like. And but this is a really cute pattern. It is a size extra large. It's basically like new. It has a little, well, you have to open up the pockets. You know how it has that threading. So, so it's basically like new. The pattern, pattern is beautiful. So this one is my favorite because I love polka dots. So cute. What's that? Oh, it's an eight. I don't know, I probably could fit this. I fluctuate between like an eight and a 10, so I don't know, but I have broad shoulders, so usually I get like a 10 in blazers. But this is so cute, it's by um, Grace. That's a size eight. This one will probably go fast. I would say anywhere from like 26 bucks and up, I probably could get for that one. We'll see. This coat, I thought this was pretty cute. It's called a 555 coat. It's a nice little jacket for girls. 
but it's like black and gray checker and then the inside has that has your different pockets and everything in here inside pockets it's a drawstring at the bottom this is a really nice coat for kids especially like back to school this is a size small it's a small but yeah it's hooded and the hood is detachable it has like a zipper in the back so it's detachable i hope you guys can see that so yeah, everything was a dollar. Original price for this was only $12.99, so that's still good. Hopefully I could get, um, I don't know, I never sold this brand before, but I kind of like it. It has the little emblem on the sleeve. Hopefully I could get anywhere from 20 to 30 bucks for that one. And then last but not least, you guys, for that haul, I think I had all together like a total of 25 items. So that was pretty cool. So for this haul, I have this nice little, it's like a raincoat. It's a champion. It's an extra large slash tall. So this one should feel pretty good. It's like a raincoat slash nice little fall jacket. It's purple. Inside is gray. Can you guys see that? up on the outside it comes with the hood and it has like that material where the rain just slides off of it it's really cute venture dry that's what it's called i guess I have so i have this dress it's exhilaration i think that's target i think that's from target it's a size two nice little summer dress little tank white dress I'm trying to get my sides and stuff together for this video you guys can see the pattern it's kind of cute so I don't know this one will probably go on eBay on auction because I I think that's a target brand I, I don't even remember looking at it I was, at some point I was just trying to get out of there but this is a Christopher Banks size 10. It's brand new with tags still. A little flower skirt. A regular like casual dress wear skirt. More for the fall. So I'll probably send this in to thread up. Ann Taylor Loft Petite. Pair of trouser pants, gray. This is the back. I'm trying to make sure you guys can see like the color, but they will be online. So next up, I have this pair of pants. It's by Eric. I never heard of this brand. Have you guys seen this brand? It's kind of like a crop looking print, so animal print. Let's see. I'm gonna get it right in the light so you can see that. See that? Yeah. They're kind of like a, I guess it's black. Kind of look bronzy to me too. Kind of just kind of like a straight leg. Well, skinny, I guess. And that is a size eight. This is just a pair of, I don't know where Charter Club is from. Do you guys know? I'm thinking that's like um, Coles or something. But this is a size 16 wide. It's just a casual blue pant. So I'll send this one into thread up. I need to put my thread up power right there. 
These next couple items are gonna go to thread up because they're my more larger sizes and I tend to do well and thread up with those sizes. This size here is the 18. So it's 18, it's by Tahari. It's an eggplant color. These are brand new, the tags. So they're so cute, new tags. Got them for a dollar. Send those into thread up as well. So I have to go back because I like to, you know, have a really big bag when I'm sending stuff into thread up. You watch some of my other videos about thread up, you'll see kind of like the process and everything that I use to send things in. Cause I figure like for a buck, you could, you know, make a couple of dollars. It's not a lot, they don't pay you a lot, but I figure if I'm paying a buck for them and they're giving me free shipping, hey, I'll send a couple things in that's less work I have to do and it does add up you know just let your money kind of add up in there this is a pair of MS never heard of this brand it's a size 16 it's just a basic striped pant button up is that still a style button up I don't know I'll send this into thread up too since it's a 16. Um, another thread up victim. These are from Eva Mendez. I know for sure that this is um, Kohl's. Her stuff sells at Kohl's. So it's just the basic pant. I think these are, yeah, these are pants. They're burgundy color. Red up. Only thing about thread up is they can reject your stuff, but most of the stuff I have, I usually get about uh, 80 something, like high 80s to 90 something percent um, rate as far as them keeping my items. This is a cute little summer skirt. It is by dress barn and it's a size 10 great for the summer so I'm gonna get this up right away it has the little babies at the bottom this is kind of cute probably get no more than about 10 bucks for this oh, oh I threw it in my thread up pile see what else we have We're getting there guys another pair of burgundy pants that's going to thread up and these are by New York and it's a size 18. They're cute, just like thread slots. Going to the thread of pal. And then I have, oh, this is a cute little skirt. It's by Italy. This doesn't look like a a or B brand, it's, it's medium, but I thought it was cute, so I picked it up. It's gonna be really nice for the fall. We got that tweed light pattern. Look at that with the little bow, it's so cute, look at the bottom. Yeah, that one is cute. So I'll, I'll probably do this, I'll probably put this one on eBay and Poshmark. It's a smaller size, so I'll probably do that. Here's a nice skirt. This skirt is by, oh, this is the Lou LaRoe. It's an XL. I don't know if people still wear this, but I usually send this into thread up and they sell really good. So yeah, people do still wear it. It's very long and it kind of flares at the bottom. And then it has like your, kind of like, I don't know what you call this, like a high band, high waist band type dress. So it's 
going to go to threaded. And lastly, you guys, I have another skirt, which is thread up. This is a 2XL. It's a Lou LaRoe also. This is a, I don't know. I may put this on eBay because it's summery like by the time I get it to thread up, it'll be too late for it. But it's new with tags. So. What I'll do is probably put it on eBay right now. So by the time I get everything else settled to go to thread up, if it hasn't sold, then it'll go to thread up. So, so I'll go ahead and put it on eBay and Poshmark. That is it. That is all I have for this haul. So like I said, today is Wednesday. I'm going to do another haul on, I'm going to do another haul on Saturday, I think if not Friday. All right, if you have any questions, let me know. This haul was, it's decent. I mean, you know, it could get me rolling because right now I'm on eBay, so I don't really have anything. I think I have probably like 10 items in there, so it's time for me to get back on the ball. So I'm just trying to like, you know, get the ball rolling on this stuff. All right, so I will see you next time. Thank you so, so much for joining me, you guys. Stay safe out there, and I love you. Peace.